The mom and I are the first ones in the car. Stacked. Three way seats. Hello, no, nope, that's no a good. <laughs> yeah. Seven hour drive, is it? Seven hours? Well, today won't be seven. It's my sister and her boyfriend. I don't think they'll want to be on any video, so it's gonna be a lot of my mom and I, and maybe my dad. My grandmother loves being on camera, as you've known from all of my other videos with her, so maybe I'll get a little glimpse of her. Yes, Bobby has quite the personality too, so it'll be good. I'll keep you guys updated, sporadically, of course. See that we're at Barden's. It's the best ice cream. You can't even see it though. Birthday cake's awesome. It's more crap. This is Barden's in Traverse City, Michigan. Go, it's the best. I'm obsessed. I've been there since I was like a little kid. And boom, right into where I stayed for the night. Yes, in the dock. Okay, so we just slept on the boat last night. I luckily, I'll do a little boat tour for you guys. Luckily, so every summer for the past like 10 years, my grandparents would stay on this boat full time, like sleep with their dogs in like the cabin area. So here's a little quick tour. I didn't get as many videos as I wanted, but oh well. This is like a quick overview of everything. And then we go to the right. Here's one bedroom with a TV. That thing flaps down to be like a bunk bed situation, I guess. It's actually a pretty comfy bed. And then you go here, there's one bedroom. It reminds me of like a airplane bathroom, but I mean, it's not that as bad as it seems. Okay, I meant to say bathroom, whatever. And then here's more of the kitchen. There's a TV up there, lots of storage, whatnot. And then this couch area like pulls out for like a bigger bed area. And their bedroom's back there. I didn't get a video of their bathroom, but it's a lot bigger than the other bathroom and they have like a shower and stuff there. So that's what they use. And then yeah, here's another little overview of the other bedroom. And I did a terrible job videoing, but they sold. I got like the couch spot and Sadie and Carter basically had a camp up top, but they're selling the boat next year. So it's our like last time on it. So it's kind of good that we got to experience it, you know, and I think we're going, just, just scratch that. I know we're going swimming today on the boat, go to the island. I'll vlog a little. I'm wearing my self love is love shirt that what's your happy hour got me. And then these shorts are from University Tees. And don't forget to use my code Penelope for free shipping or Penelope 10 for 10% off. And I just woke up not too long ago, had a bagel for breakfast, some raspberries, celebrated with some Potter's cake. If you're from Traverse City, Potter's, or not even from, if you ever visit Traverse City, Potter's cake is the absolute best. And as I was walking to the like yacht club to change and get ready for the day, cause it's kind of hard to do that on the boat. I saw the biggest one I've ever seen. I was so close to it. Add me on snaps for updates like that. Um, but yeah. So we had a little boat day, which is kind of sad because that means it was our last one because they recently sold a boat. So now I'm looking back at all this footage and it's like nostalgic, but there's Buddy. Buddy is a trooper. He's literally like 14 years old, still still kicking it. Um, Yeah, here's a little boat day. We did swim, but like more like a jump in, jump out moment because it was freezing, freezing. And then we went to our family friend's house and they have boats and a lot of cool stuff. So we celebrated there me do i wakeboard mm, no because i have anxiety so i just watch so please enjoy everyone uh surfboard wakeboarding whatever it's called yeah i wish i could do it for you guys maybe next year just happened we went on the jet ski Sadie got on for three seconds and we all fell into the water yay Carter's out there doing his thing on the jet ski thumbs up oh Maisie OMG look at her go she swims literally everywhere Oh, she looks scared. Is she looking for a fish? Maze, what are you backing up for? I wonder what she, maybe she's... There's Carter out there. And Knuckles. Knuckles. Knuckles swimming. It's okay. So jump in. I want to see you jump in. Oh. Say, so try to get him to jump. <gasps> Come on. Come on. Oh, 
Come on. He could have paid the $30, instead he paid the 10 so. <laughs> and then we went to Mackinac Island. This is us getting on the ferry in Mackinac City. I realized I didn't really explain what we're doing, so you just kind of have to guess and follow along. How fun is that? Since everyone loves my voiceovers, I figured I would do our little, like, ferry ride voiceover to explain Mackinac Island and Mackinac City. So it's spelled, like, Mackinac. It's kind of, like, a popular place, actually. You have to take a ferry from, like, two locations. It's, like, a 12-minute ferry ride to the island it is so cool it's literally like disney but real life there's no motor vehicles allowed on the entire island so literally like horse-drawn carriages are what you like use as a taxi and people bike everywhere and there's like one tiny little school on the island it is like the coolest place ever um and i went there when i was a little kid and they have like amazing like fudge shops and i haven't been there since like fourth grade so it was really nostalgic and like cool like look at this come on this is like disney Hello everyone, Bubby and Papa. So here's a little tour of where we were staying. Shout out to my dad's friend who owns this like, I believe it's the Applewood Apartments. Um, we literally took, see that, that's like a horse-drawn carriage to get there. And then this was the apartment I was staying in with my parents. Cool view, you could literally see the lake. That was a pull-out couch for me. And then up there, there's like this lofted area. Very cool. We were not aware it didn't have um, air conditioning, but we dealt with it because there were fans everywhere. So people were positive, but um, it's hot, you know. Something you'd like to know ahead of time, but it's fine. We rolled with the punches. Um, and then here's a little downtown view. And would you look at that? It is storming. A storm's a brewing. If you saw my TikTok about it. So shocker, I did not want to bike in the rain, so I waited with my grandparents for the carriage and my mom rode my bike in literally a dress because she's the best and I have too much anxiety to bike in the pouring rain. Um, Bubby and I caught in the rain, thunderstorm. I decided I wasn't capable of biking, but I didn't want to, so I'm taking a horse taxi with Bubby. When it comes? Yes, in 20 minutes. Right. In the rain. <laughs> Okay, after the rain, look how beautiful it is. Like, come on. And my mom's literally the best. She would record so much content for me. Half of this is videoed by her. This is us walking our bikes back. I feel like she didn't have a bike or something, but also it was so hard to go up this ginormous hill that you'll see in a second. I hope we have a picture of this hill because if we don't, just know that it was huge and my sister and I both had to get off of our bikes to walk it up. This isn't the hill that I was talking about. Shoot, um, just believe me, yeah. My mom literally took this while she was running around the island. It's like an eight mile run slash bike ride that we do every time we go. I don't even think we do the full one, to be honest. So that's kind of a flex, but she's the best supporting my career, always filming for me. Like, come on. My dad literally went in to take pictures of us that I will insert. Ignore my double chin in that. Uh, next up, we had a little lunch and golf outing and I thought this was going to be mini putt. I was actually wrong. It's like mini putt, but more like real golf putting just in smaller areas. Does that make sense? There's no like windmills. There's no like fun little things. It's just like a bunch of golf putting holes. So I was not as good as it as I actually expected. Even though I went on a mini golf tour with my boyfriend two summers ago, we were amazing. So gonna win golf me. me definitely me because my dad will probably put some prize money in it and that's when i think it's worth it tend to exactly exactly all right so it looks like sadie already went in this i'm gonna do a little voiceover she didn't make it in first try so she's upset as she would be knowing her she's super competitive too um and then carter's up next i believe this was the first hole let's see how he does little practice swing Oh, 
Okay, similar to Sadie, it's not bad, but not amazing. Obviously, didn't go in right away. Um, I don't think either of them fully watch my YouTube videos. Actually, I know Sadie just, like, clicks and makes it, like, seem like it was watched as, like, part of my engagement, but she doesn't fully watch it because, like, why would she watch them? But she does support and like it normally. So, the chances of her seeing this, very slim, but... Yeah, I hope you don't care that I'm exposing your terrible golfing because I actually think that I did beat her in the end of this. I'm not 100% sure. Hopefully, I putt soon. I don't know what I'm waiting for. Okay, let's get it, Penelope. Also, ignore the way I'm standing in my posture. I absolutely hate it. So, okay, I killed that. That was amazing. Almost hole in one. Okay, why am I walking like that? Ugh. Narrating one's life from like an outside perspective is very trippy and not a lot of people have to do this. So, oh, close. Also went to this like old time fort museum that we had to walk up a bunch of stairs to get to. I'm honestly not sure why we did this because we've already done it before. It's kind of like reenactment type stuff. Just it's literally, this boat. is the boat. Oh. My dad's. That's crazy. I bet that's you right there in the red. I don't think I'd be up for it on that one right then. But it could be. Well, pretend it is for God's sake. I, I, mean, I mean, it's our boat. I just don't know what year that was from. Also, if you go to Mackinac Island, you need to get the fudge. Like, it is a staple. There's so many of them there. And then this was our way back. Nice and windy. Um, I did post a lot of TikToks from the trip because I recently made it to the Creator Fund. So please go follow me on TikTok at Penelope underscore three and four.